What's going on, guys? I bet all of us have said, fuck that grill whenever we work on an Audi or something else. Especially if you are doing waterless wash like me. So, here is how to clean a honeycomb grill in five minutes or less, depending on how dirty it is. Uh, this can be applied to both your pressure washer method and or rinseless wash. So what we've got is some all-purpose cleaner from Shine Supply or whatever other brand you want. Soak that grill real good. Uh, get yourself like a soft brush of some sort and spray that thing with product too. And rub it real good into all those honeycombs. Um, yeah, I know there's carbon fiber down there that I just brushed with the brush, but this is a beater car, so the owner doesn't care. Um, and hit it real good. Get it nice and sudsy with your product. Take your pump sprayer and or pressure washer and pump it up and rinse all of that all-purpose cleaner out of there. If you have a pump sprayer, this can take a while. See, look at all that dirt running down out of there. This car was filthy, but I um, figured it would be a good car to make this video with. Because cleaning honeycomb grills is really frustrating and time consuming. And rather than sitting there and individually going through every little honeycomb with a towel and wiping up dirt <laughs> save a few steps or make it easier later by getting rid of um, most of that dirt and agitating everything so now grab a blower which i've got my air blaster sidekick with a home depot vacuum extension on it so that i don't have to i get a i don't gotta sit so close to stuff i can reach into places this is probably the longest part of cleaning the grill is blowing it out And you might want to wear your plugs because I'm sure all of us who have used a blower know how horrible it sounds when you blow into a small crevice like that. Make sure you're really thorough in drying so your last step uh, will be easier. All right, <clears throat> once you're done drying it off with that, go and grab yourself a towel of some sort. Crappy towel, nice towel, whatever. I just went with the crappy towel. And now you are gonna still have to go through each honeycomb. However, it's just a quick dab with your finger to get whatever's left out of there and finish drying. So still kind of a pain in the ass, but I'm not spending 20 minutes cleaning this grill. I'm only spending five minutes. I'm sure a lot of you have probably skipped cleaning grills in the past because it was just too much of a pain and generally the customer doesn't notice that. I've done it before, um, you know, on some really messed up cars or ones that have ridiculous grills, but don't do that. Uh, I, had, I have changed my ways. You can change yours too. So this is cleaning a grill in five minutes. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Stay tuned for more videos and fun stuff. And we will catch you next time. Nice and clean.